Well, thank you, Neil. You know, one of the things that occurs to me looking at this crowd is um, being Irish sticks with you and stays with you. Uh, in my case, my paternal grandparents were born in Ireland, my, my paternal grandfather in County Monaghan, my paternal grandmother in County Mayo, my uh, uh, other grandparents were uh, temporary, Mr. Ryan, from whence the Ryans came. Um, and then they came and they settled in Chicago, uh, on the south side of Chicago. There's a, there's a south side Irish thing in Chicago, but uh, Bill O'Reilly, your comments, uh, the neighborhood I grew up in was called the Three Eye League, much like the, the reference you made in, from Levittown. So I grew up in a neighborhood which was a mixed neighborhood, uh, was educated by Irish Dominican nuns in grammar school, Irish Christian brothers in high school, and no one in my family had ever gone to college, and <laughs> my dream was to go to Notre Dame. But I think even more important, it was my father's dream that I go to Notre Dame. So when I was accepted, Father John, I probably would not have been accepted today, given the standards today. But I was excited. He, as an Irishman, was even more excited for the admission to Notre Dame. <clears throat> After uh, college, uh, I had the privilege and pleasure of marrying a, a, a redheaded Irish lady, uh, my wife Joni, who we have had, she had eight children. Uh, as Neil mentioned earlier, 24 grandchildren now three great-grandchildren, and to keep the Irish heritage moving, two of my grandchildren are, ma are now married. They married a Durkin and an O'Gara, so I think, <laughs> I, think we're, I, think we're, I think we're okay. And I, I would say one other comment about being honored in this group. Uh, I'm particularly honored with, with the with the folks today, but especially Pat Ryan, who I have no dearer friend than Pat, and it's, it's a real privilege, and also Don Keel. I, Don's not here in person, but you know Don is here. And so many of us in this room are here because of Don Keogh's love for Ireland. And while I already ha always had that affection, I can tell you Don moved it on. So I want to thank all of you, Neil, uh, thank Irish America, thank you all for being here, and thank Don Keogh. I think he had a little help in nudging some of us along. So thanks and good luck to everybody, and congratulations to all the other honorees.